Okay, so somebody said, if you don't like the male version of yourself, you should really humble yourself. Well. Bitch. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Bitch. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women... Salute, King. That's what I'm trying to tell these young women out here, these black women in particular. They don't want to humble themselves. They don't want to be submissive. They don't want to lose that weight. They don't want to lick between their man's ass crack. They don't want to kiss their toes, kiss their feet, open the door when they get there. They don't want to do that. But then they get mad that, that a white woman going to do it. You humble yourself and lick between my ass. You know what women don't be doing? Mm -hmm. Exactly, my brother. And just to piggyback off of what you were saying, my mom had four kids and 17 different jobs. So while my daddy was out smoking henny and drinking crack and putting all of our money into hookers, my mother was at home with her kids or slaving away at her job. And what I don't understand is where are the women like that? Nah, you speaking facts, bro. They don't exist no more. And this is what I be saying. Women are too emotional. I like to think critically and logically. And this is exactly why when they come over to chill, I got to cover up the whole lot punched in the wall when the Lakers lost because they just, they don't understand. Exactly, my fellow alpha males. How do you expect me to marry you? when you can't even clean my ass correctly. The audacity for these females to think I'm gonna get home from a long day of cheating and being neglectful toward my responsibilities and family. You are not rushing to the door to take my shoes off and kiss my feet after you've worked long and hard. These bitches be tripping, bro. You ever thought about going to therapy? If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? What I'm saying is if my wife can't get her shit together after I've had babies with her, like, I'm out, bro. Like, ew. I deserve a hot woman. This alpha male deserves a hot woman. I'm about to spend my crib. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Bro, this is not the same females that our fathers and our grandfathers was dealing with. Look, we gave them the right to vote and read. And how do they repay us? You can't even cook me a home-cooked meal after I come home from a long day of cheating on you. Like, what's wrong with you? What are you bringing to the table? If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? And these females need to be fit, feminine, and friendly. They don't understand a high-value man. When my mama finally got me out the basement, I was probably about 36, 37. I can't. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Bro, they're all disposable, like all of them. At this point, I don't even want them anymore. No women. I don't want any women. All I want is men. Women have the audacity to get pregnant and have babies? Like, why would you do that? Why would my mom have me? I don't even want to be here. I kind of want to die. So what? All I care about is women's bodies and their beautiful curves. It's not like I want to be one all the time. Of course, I'm a high value man. My pee pee touches the water when I sit down to pee. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Totally, bro. It's like these females are just so fucking selfish. Men only want one simple thing, and that's sex. And they just refuse to give it to us. It's like they use it as a weapon. I was talking to this girl the other day. She told me she was celibate. Like, what is that? Everyone knows that only virgins can be celibate. Like, what do you have a pussy for if you're not going to fucking use it? <laughs> and then they just want all your money. I had this girl the other day. It took her, took her to Applebee's, bro. Applebee's. We got the two for 20, and I got her a dessert. At the end of the day, I got a hug. A fucking hug. I deserved at least a blowjob. At least. It's like these females just don't understand that all we want to do is sleep with them so that we can call them a whore the next day and then brag to all our friends about how we coerce them into sleeping with us because initially she told us no. Like, I'm a fucking high value man. I make $30,000 a year. I am in my mid 30s, no kids, and I have a podcast. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? 
So what if she has two masters and a PhD in psychology and makes over 50,000 more than me? <laughs> what does she bring to the table? I have my own partially furnished apartment. I have my own 2007 Kia and I keep my pantry fully stocked with every flavor of ramen noodles. She's clearly not used to an alpha male in her presence. <laughs> Only them beta males. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? You guys are fucking simps, bro. Being nice to your girl and taking her out and shit. <laughs> Who's taking me out? Who's providing for me? <laughs> I'm the prize. I'm high value. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? You see, my brother, I agree with you. Women, females, bitches. You see, these women do not understand that a key that opens any lock is a master key. I am an alpha male. Mom? Yes, I've done the dishes. Black women, makeup, BBL, what do you bring to the table? You see, no man wants a woman with a used vagina. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? No, 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 no. Girls just, like, don't go for nice guys anymore. There's this girl I've been DMing for, like, months, and she hasn't replied to me a single time. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Oh, oh shit. So the other day I was sexing this female, and I asked where her body count was, and she said four. Nick, four? Automatic block. Can't deal. Why did I block her? Man, I don't do sluts, okay? My grandmother only had one lover and that was my grandfather, okay? My grandfather was a true blue provider, okay? He had two to three families down the street he was raising all at the same time. My guy was providing all day, every day, you feel me? My grandmother knew the whole time and it didn't matter to her because she still had 10 of his kids and worked two to three jobs. Until I can find me a female like that, I am not settling, you hear me? You see, fellas, we can't lose sight of the fact that we are the prize, okay? You gotta keep in mind that men think logically and females think emotionally, and because of that, it makes logical sense that men are the keys and females are the locks to the door. If you've already had four keys in your lock, what am I gonna do, be the fifth? I think the fuck not. If her body count is more than three, how can she reset me? See, females be selfish. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Uh-oh. <laughs> Boys are asking me all the time, what's the biggest takeaway from AlphaCon 2022? Automation and networking. Get yourself an Amazon store. That's passive income. I woke up this morning, already made 300. Didn't even lift a finger, which means now I have time to focus on myself, focus on my goals, focus on my physique. Focus on finding myself a big booty queen who's going to dry scoot pre-workout with me and hit the gym at 4 a.m. And if she's not willing to do that, then she's not my soulmate. And there's plenty of women out there who are looking to be handled by an alpha male. Okay, boys, it's time to man up. Alpha mentality from here on out. Change your life. Kyle out. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? I, like their standards now are just up to here. They're unrealistic. I was like, okay, you want a high value man? Well, answer me this. Are you willing to stop thinking? Stop speaking? Because how else you going to... I'm Todd Toddley. I'm a single virgin without kids. And I am an expert on motherhood. Let's get into it. These women, they become obsessed with their baby. You know, they're always off, I don't know, changing their kid's diaper. It's like, who is going to change my diaper? You know what I mean? I am gonna go find another woman to change my diaper, and that's on you, girl. I'm a numbers guy. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I'm a math guy. I'm sorry, a baby weighs what? Seven, eight pounds, max? Okay, that's how much you should gain when you're pregnant. The big myth out there is that childbirth is painful. Who says? As a high value alpha masculine male, I want my wife to comb my balding head for me. 
I expect my wife to brush my teeth every single day, no hesitation. Yes, she should put my socks on for me as well. Exactly. When I come home from playing games and sleeping around with women, I want to see children in bed. Facial stuff ready. Food ready. Oil for back massage ready. Hair sat down and quiet. Come ready for my no hair. I want my hair shaved bald. <laughs> You know what I bring to the table is and uh, I give her a stomach ache. How wonderful, like lactose intolerant. Amazing, you know what I give her stress, like cutting grass with scissors. Amazing, I think we make them very happy. We make them f Listen, 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 listen. I think the problem is with this day and age, females, they want um it's it's not they they want to be treated the same exact way that a man should be treated but i think what people don't understand is that physically and mentally men i'm not saying they're stronger because we're just stronger there are scientific facts that show that men are stronger that there is a foundation that men were born with and it's not personal females think everything is so personal not everything can be changed and they say they want equality but if i brought them to taco bell would they pick up the tab if i brought them to a restaurant if they asked me out would they pick up the tab it's always a triple standard with them If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? If I sleep with you, I've marked my territory, right? And then you go and sleep with another one of the mandems. We're done. We don't need a title. This is not a novel. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Females don't understand their own body. Because, see, they're not even supposed to be menstruating because of the fact When, when females cheat, their heart is in it. And that shit hurts. They don't even realize. It's all emotions. It's all tied together. But when a man cheats, listen, listen to me, okay? Listen to this part. When a man cheats, it's just physical, right? Right. And you can't even disagree with me on this. It's only physical. There's no, your heart isn't in it. There's no emotion attached. It's literally just a hole. And those females out here don't get it. Like, they be whining, oh, it's a double standard. Yeah, and it should be that way. Because with you, it's emotion. With me, it's not. Men on podcasts See, be like. See, about a man's protection. The value of a real high-value man. I'm watching my mama shovel the snow right now. Okay, you see, you see the snow outside. I'm watching her from the inside and the comforts of the living room. But, but my male prowess will detect. See, will detect if there's any danger. We a protection, ladies. Get with the winning team, ladies. A rose can't do that, sweetheart. Now nah, nah, my brother, let me lay it out for you. Females today ask me for too much. They want you to wipe your own ass, call them pretty, take them on dates, not fuck other bitches. As a high value man, I need a woman who is going to submit to me, a woman who is going to... If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Women today don't listen to men anymore. The other day I had a woman try and tell me I don't understand women immediately after I just finished explaining to her how women are. Exactly. Like, how hard is it to understand that as a high value man myself, I want a woman with a low value weight? Because as men, it doesn't matter what we bring to the table. Like, we built that table. Modern women today have an ego problem because they can't even be grateful that out of the six girls their man is currently fucking, they're the number one one. I mean, like, call me old fashioned, but if my wife doesn't give me a blowjob as soon as I walk in the door as a thank you, like, I'm out. You know, because I know my value. Evolutionarily speaking, men are programmed for polygamy, but these women don't want to hear science. To all straight black men out there, you don't need a podcast.
See, see, now that's the problem, though, because, like, if she's not submissive, then what's the point? See, now that's the problem. That I can't do that. See, with me, if I have a wife and we have a child together, I'm there through a whole pregnancy, and she does not snap back, like, right away, I have every right to leave her and that baby. Like, that's not even my child anymore. I mean, it's, it's nothing personal. It's preference. I'm a high-value man. It doesn't matter what I look like. What is up guys? Welcome back to the Alpha Big Dick Muscle Man Podcast. <laughs> for those who are new, this podcast is for high value men and high value men only. No beta simps allowed. Today we're going to be addressing how us big dick, big muscle, high value men are under attack. We are under attack by the modern woman. Oh, I was almost respectful. By the modern female. Here's the thing, my dudes. I'm about to say something revolutionary, unique. No one's ever said this before. Listen up, take notes. A key that opens many locks is a master key. <laughs> Mom, you're in the shot. Huh? Get out of the shot. <laughs> Get out of the shot. <laughs> but a lock, oh, my, my beard. But a lock opened by multiple keys is just a shitty lock. Revolutionary. In conclusion, if her body count is over zero, on to the next. Well, now that my lighting's adjusted, let's really get into it. My dudes, you gotta get you a female who's gonna satisfy you in every avenue. <laughs> Her body count should be under zero, but she also needs to know how to please you. She has to be a freak in the sheets. How is she supposed to satisfy you? She has zero experience. Uh, Next question, next question. So a woman has to have a body count under zero to find a man? Correct, exactly. And alpha men have to have multiple body counts to be considered alpha men? Yes. Basically what I'm saying is, as soon as a female gets with me, she can't get with anybody else because her value has gone down. It's done, over with, you can't replenish it. For me, I get all the bodies, I get all the females. Snatching virginities left and right. Listen, come closer. It's not supposed to make sense. It's not supposed to make sense. <laughs> start a podcast you know what women don't be doing oh yeah these females today they're so entitled we gave them the right to vote and they're stretching it they want more it's like they don't know what a good man is you know all i ask of her is to have no personality no opinion always look good have my house clean and have dinner ready for me and be ready to lay down whenever i ask her to i don't care if you had a long day like what do you think my day was like i need that and if you don't want to give it to me, then I'll just go find it from a 19-year-old. She'll do it. And you know what? It's not cheating because men aren't wired like that, you see. And our value goes up. These females don't understand that when they sleep around, their value goes down. She's lucky I even let her in the house. She slept with two men before me. No. She's really for the streets. So I'm doing her a favor. It's not cheating. But you know what is cheating? If she has a TikTok. You know, if she has any social media. Because you know what that means? She's selling herself to find another mate. That's what she's doing. Leave her for the streets, kings. You deserve more. As a black woman, why are you dating outside the race? I don't get it. What? If I start dating white girls, I'm labeled as a coon. Exactly, but you're an alpha male. Well, it's my preference though. It's my preference. Why can't black women get the same treatment as black men? Word, I word, don't get word. it. Bad vibes. Next question, man. Would you pay on the first date? Yeah, I got a girlfriend, but I'm not in a relationship. I'm single. Yeah. But I got, you know, we 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 was together for two years. And I probably cheated on her, like, probably a year and 11 months out of that. <laughs> no funny shit. But you know, the thing, the reason why we broke up is because she cheated on me. She retaliated. And I'm just like, <laughs> I'm not going to put up with that shit, bro. You a hoe. You cheat on me after I cheat on you, or you, you cheat on me, period, you a hoe. And you got no respect for yourself, no morals, you don't love yourself. And you you know what I'm saying? Like, you don't got no, your values is on the floor, your self-esteem is on the floor. You understand what I'm saying, bro? Like, I'm not putting up with that shit. I will not, exactly, bro. Like, you feel me? Women are not supposed to cheat. My mother, she never cheated on my father. My father used to dog her shit out. Why shouldn't she? Because she's not a hoe. But my ex, she's a hoe. 
She got fed up with me cheating and that, so she want to retaliate and do what I do. Be yourself. <laughs> be yourself, queen. Nah, they be preaching on this whole feminine, you know, feminism or whatever that shit is called and women empowering and shit like that. But then you want to do some dickhead shit and do, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't shit, but then you want to do what I do. Be yourself, queen. Be yourself, queen. Be yourself. You know what I'm saying? Don't do what I do. Don't do what I do. Because if you ain't, like, if you saying that I ain't shit, neither are you. You're not supposed to do it back. Your job is to cook, clean, and give me the, mm. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm going to do it. Bro, I've had good girls before. I'm going to still cheat. <laughs> I've had women do give the world for me. I'm still cheat. That's just what I do. I'm, I'm going to stop cheating when I feel like it. But if you do it, you a hoe. That's that. <clears throat> Is this thing on females, right? Makeup, BBLs. Why? Why do you need it? Over 150, obese, black bitches, ugly. What you mean about my black mama? My mama a queen. Me, strong man. Alpha, you, beta. What do you bring to the table? A degree? A car? Me? I bring dominance. Masculinity. You need a masculine man in your life. I keep telling y'all, I am an alpha. Bitches. They're everywhere. Get you a strong masculine man like me. Jonathan, baby, come no, get your food. I'm not hungry. I might be 5'2", but you will never stand near me. Never. You are, and you will always be, a female! Alpha. Me. L let me explain this to y'all. And this is a complete original thought. If women were locks, and men were keys, hmm? Sluts. And that's exactly why all you bitches these days are single. And see, that's the problem. These females don't know how to be submissive. All they want to do is go to school, start a business, be financially independent, try to get some healing emotionally, go to therapy. All of this irrelevant stuff. My mama never had to do any of that. My mama is the pinnacle of what I look for in a female. My mama cook, my mama clean, my mama read me bedtime stories, my mama is always there to tuck me. See, that's why I don't even mess with sisters like that. I date outside my race, you know, because what can a black woman do for me? The only black woman who, who seen relevant is what? Michelle Obama. See, and, and, and she ain't even really black for real. She's just from Chicago. I don't mess with people that's in my race. See, I like to broaden my horizons because they're a lot more submissive if they ain't black. You know, I mean, I got a black mama and a black sister, but see, I need somebody that's going to be submissive. And, and what can a black woman do for me, really? I ain't racist or nothing like that. It's just a preference for me, dog. It's just a preference. I got and see the reason why a lot of these women is single is the, the word submit to them is foreign. Think about the word submit. When you're subbing, you are replacing. Okay. They, they, they need to replace the feelings of, 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 of dominance with, with, with submission. Is what I'm saying. And when, when you think about it like this, King, when you really sit down and think about it, submit is two syllables. So so why can't we have two women? If, if you got to sub and then you got to admit, you need two people for that. That's all I'm saying. This is why these females are single. Why are we as men, as alphas, taking females on dates? You see what I'm saying? As the manager of the local McDonald's, I've just come across females that only want me for my pockets. So if I ask a woman on a date to inadvertently trick her into having sex with me, we should be able to go to Wendy's and sit in the car and eat. You see what I'm saying? If a lock can open a key, she's a slut. Um, I just want to know where the natural women are. What happened to natural women? I, you know, I don't understand why they, these females love to cover up their face and this, that, and the third. It doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. 
because they want money. You see what I'm saying? Like, ugh. And fucking black women? <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Come on. Ew. I can't, I can't, I can't take them out in public. They're goddamn fucking animals. If I look like this, I would start a podcast. You know what women don't be doing? Evolutionary reason why women aren't funny. And look, I'm a science guy, right? I'm a data guy. I love Excel spreadsheets. And what she got to bring to the table. And what she got to bring to the table. This is for my high value men and my high value men only. I want y'all to notice something. Do you notice that when you say the word woman, you can't say it without man. The word man is in woman, meaning a woman always has a man in her. And that these low value females are used up and stretched out and they are not worth your time. Stay woke, kings.